Okay, this tutorial will be about um, flipping the normals in case something's transparent on your build. Um, I'm just going to add a, a cube. Go into edit mode. Press N on your keyboard. In fact, I will start display. So press N on your keyboard, find shading, 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 and click on back face culling. Now, I'm going to show you how to flip your normals back, but first I will um, reverse it. Okay, now you can see the, uh, this is what the object will look like in Second Life, that's why backface culling is on. You can see the, the box is transparent. Now you would normally select all just for this box, but if it's a particular face, you would select a face, go down to Mesh, Normals, Recalculate Outside. So Mesh, Normals, Recalculate Outside and recalculate inside if you want it in the reverse direction and then that will give you your face on the outside so you select all mesh normals recalculate outside and now you have a outside of a box if it's a area like so I will just make that I'll just shrink these edges in a sec oh. let's do that again okay if it's like that on the inside or if it's like it on the outside and not the inside so I'll just reverse that if it looks like that what you'll need to do is select the faces or you can select all select the faces and mesh normals recalculate outside and then your box will be normal there's one here or you can select all mesh normals recalculate outside and that should give you your box to save a DAE file mesh export collider data sorry file export collider data um, save it to wherever you need slide the little slider down now you want apply modifiers on in case you added modifiers you want all of these ones on here uh, export for open sim you do not want triangulate on so triangulate off export for open sim all of the texture options and apply modifiers then name your object press enter and then press enter again I won't save this particular file uh, after you name it just press enter or export collider data to color a face Second Life will only accept eight colored faces so if you wanted the outside one color the first color you choose with the little materials tab will be the entire color so I'm just going to make that and then assign so still got the faces chosen click on the plus sign new and then change the color you want it to and then click assign Yeah, 
it for some reason. I don't know why that face is there. I'll just delete that face. If you want to choose the face and then choose another face of the same colour, do that and then click assign. Okay, that's all for that tutorial.